What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to be putting on these Mobula 6 Happy Model motors back on the frame. We're going to be doing something a little different with these though. The connectors that are on your flight controller, we're going to be removing them. And to remove these, you just got to pull them off and you're going to be left with the three pins that are soldered onto the flight controller. Go ahead and desolder those pins and you'll be left with three pads just like you see here on my flight controller and we will be soldering those motor wires directly to those pads. I've already completed this on my HD Mobula 6 build and I do think uh, that there is a decent amount of performance uh, that is improved after doing this. Using the connectors is good and all but when you solder the wires directly on the motor's performance will increase and it will be able to pull better uh, current and more current as it needs. So anyways, to get started, let's just uh, go ahead and start installing one of the motors. When you're cutting your wires, make sure that they are long enough to reach the flight controller because once you cut them too short, it's going to be a pain in the ass because you're going to have to solder a little uh, extension to make it longer, which I had to do at one point. So just make sure that you don't cut them short, that way they reach the flight controller. When you're doing this, also make sure that the order of the wires are correct. If not, your motor will be spinning the opposite way, but you can always fix that and be a heli. I chose to just map them correctly with the wires the way they were in the connector. That way I don't have to do all that configuration. Here you can see that I have soldered all three of the wires. So let's move on to the next motor and solder all three of those wires. All right, so we got all our motors installed. Everything is supposed to be spinning the right way. As you can see, I got a new camera mount on here. I printed this little TPU mount instead of using the canopy that came with the Mobula 6. It has a much smaller profile and I just think it looks better. Just check out the Mobula 6 again, the HD version. Uh, we got the uh, HD camera in there with that PCB SD card for the HD footage and I'm running the 25,000 kV motors on uh, the HD version and then on the regular version I'm running the 19,000 kV motors. And I just quickly wanted to show you guys my Gep RC Phantom while we're at it. Uh, this is one of my favorite drones. I love flying this thing. It's really small yet powerful. It's great to carry this Runcam Thumb Pro. And uh, yeah, so that's it. Thanks for watching, guys.